Hey everyone, my name is Chris Anderson and I'm here today with Abdul, who's going to explain to us how they grow nanotubes, carbon nanotubes. So Abdul, walk us through the process of how you, how you grow these, these things. Okay, thank you. Uh, so how I grow carbon nanotube, actually for growing carbon nanotube, one, is, one, is the, one of the process is we need to have metal catalyst seed, like where the carbon nanotube start growing. This is like a metal Seeds, atom. like sharp, yeah. Metal uh, particle, not atom. A it particle. might have a million of uh, atom together, okay. but it is a, s a spherical shape or round shape particle, like uh, metal. We call it seeds, like where carbon nanotube actually start growing from. Oh, okay. So, so here, so this would be uh, a group of metal yeah. uh, atoms, atom, and together. then the carbon tube would just like start yeah. adding growing. onto itself. Yeah. Okay. So the carbon kind of self assembles. Yeah, self assemble and grow upward vertically. Okay, so what what kind of metals do you guys use so for I, enzymes? I use actually iron metal okay. with, with like combined with alumina. Both has a good like actually uh, like uh, combination to grow a uh, long tube. That's why I use actually alumina supported iron metal seeds. Okay, uh, so how do you do that well, in the lab? Okay, so I actually first uh, synthesize like grow these uh, metal seeds chemically in mm -hmm. solution then i uh, actually put this like spread these like nanoparticle or seeds in the substrate you know substrate is like a soil where like a lot of plants tree grow from so all right let me get so let me get this straight so you you take your your seeds your your aluminum and iron, iron seeds iron. you plant the seeds in a silicon dioxide yeah aluminum soil yeah, wafer yeah, yeah. And then you put that in a special oven. Now, yeah. how hot does that oven get? Like 800 degrees Celsius. Okay. So, and then in addition to heat, you guys also add some sort of carbon-based gas. Yeah. And then they just like burp, 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 yeah. pop so, right up. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, can we see the 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 final product? So uh, after uh, growing tube, like uh, on the substrate, you can see the substrate with lots yeah. of nanotube, like very oh, black. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. So all, the, all those lines there are the carbon nanotubes. Yeah, those, those are actually spinable. So you know, those attach one other so we can make a fiber from them. And oh, they are attached, aren't they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I see, back there. Yeah. Look at, the, oh, you can stretch it. Yeah, yeah, you can see lots of like We're tube together coming through and we can make a that. fiber. Well, Abdul, thank you so much for sh showing us how you how you grow yeah, nanotubes. Thank you so much for giving me a chance to talk about this. Yeah, also. you have a really cool job. <laughs> yeah, yeah, thank you. <laughs> love science? Of course you do. So stay up to date on all things science around Scentsy by subscribing to our channel and follow us on Instagram and Twitter at Sci Around Scentsy.